Hey guys, in today's video we're going to be going over how to make the RGB split effect in Adobe Premiere Elements, so let's get started. Alright guys, so I've dragged a few clips into the timeline, and so, so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to cut the clip where we want the split to happen, so we're just going to cut it right... I'll just do it here. Alright. Now we're going to copy this clip. Right. Paste it three times. Then stack it on top of each other. Alright. So now we're going to go to the, the top clip. Uh, go to your effects panel. Under advanced um, advanced adjustments, there should be channel mixer. Drag that, and you're gonna need it on all three. All right. So to the first one, you're gonna put red red as 100, and then change green green to zero and blue to blue to zero. All right. Then the second one, red, red to zero, green to green, stays at 100, and blue to blue, we're gonna change to zero. And then the last one, red, zero, green, zero, and blue, we're gonna stay at 100. So now, we're going to look at the clip, go to Opacity, and then change the Blend Mode over here to Screen. All right. And then you're going to do sa the same thing to the second clip. Alright, now the last step, so go, go to your first clip. Um, well actually, it doesn't really matter for your first. Let's go to our second. We're going to change, go to the Motion. And on the scale, just type in, I think what it looks best would be around 105. Alright, so now you can see a little bit of it happening. And then the last one, let's do 110. Now this can vary um, like a ton. It doesn't really matter. Um, it doesn't have to be 105 and 110. It can be whatever you want. But now we've created this effect. Oops. Alright. Well, let's see how we can make this into um, a transition. So we have this clip. Stop it here. And let's transition into this clip. Alright. So let's zoom in, let's cut the clip on, uh, let's cut both clips on the very ends of them, just like this, alright, um, I'm gonna copy these two, and then paste them three times. Now let's do the same thing as before. All right, so we've made our two um, RGB splits right here. So let's see what it looks like. you can make it into more of a transition. If you want even more of a smoother 
kind of feel. You can cut off, let's clip it like right there on both sides. And we're gonna create kind of a zoom effect. So going over here, let's go to motion. The first one we're gonna change now. We're gonna change the first one to at least 105. Okay, second, 110, and the third, we're gonna do 115. All right, 115. All right, this one, we're gonna do the exact same thing. creates a zoom into the next clip. Let's see what that looks like. So you can mess with this a ton. Uh, you can make the zoom bigger, smaller, or you could just keep it without. Um, uh, yeah, you can use it as an effect, a transition. Um, it's a pretty popular effect, so I'll just finish up the edit and show it to you. demonstrated a few ways to use the effect. Um, hope this was a helpful video. Feel free to like and subscribe. Uh, it really helps me out. See you next video.